everyone and welcome to day five of vlogmas um you are sitting in my room with me while i fold my clothes um because i literally haven't like filmed the entire day i've just been hanging out downstairs and um just kind of like watching tv and hanging out with my dog and stuff and i did my laundry i did the dishes i've um done a bunch of other things but just talk to you guys and tell you guys what's been going on today and just kind of update everybody so i think i'm going to paint my nails tonight and make some dinner i've been reading and watching pretty little liars today i've been watching youtube videos i'm trying to stay on top of watching youtube videos because i um, know that vlogmas is actually coming up for a lot of people this week it starts on Tuesday, Wednesday, depending on how you upload. And I know with my busy, busy schedule during the week on Tuesdays and Wednesdays, I'm not going to have that much time to watch. So I'm trying to make sure that I'm keeping up with everybody that's been uploading today and tomorrow and stuff before Vlogmas really gets super crazy. But one thing that I did want to talk about, because I was like, this is the weirdest thing that's ever happened, not ever happening, this is the weirdest thing, and I just need to talk about it. So, late last night before I was going to bed, and if you ever noticed this, let me know down below if any of you have, like, noticed this, but whenever you have, like, really weird dreams at night, and then you, like, start figuring out, wait, that happened to me during the day before I went to bed, um, and it like kind of, it, it's almost like different things that you did that day pull into your like subconscious and make your dream like super duper strange. And I just want to talk about this weird dream that I had. So last night I had this weird dream where before I should probably add context. So before I went to bed, I was on TikTok and I was scrolling through there and I ended up on this video of this girl that... Um, was one of the ones that ended up getting secret Santa gifts from Taylor Swift and she like did a whole story time talking a story time talking about how she ended up being one of the people that got the secret Santa gifts from Taylor Swift and um, and then I ended up on this other girl's page that has this um, that has this little cute little chubby baby and she is adorable her name is Hazel and I was scrolling through her videos and watching her and then and like she did a video talking about how um there was nothing actually like wrong with her or anything like that but people kept commenting so she had to turn the comments off because people were saying mean things about her daughter and um so that all happened well then i go to sleep and then i end up having this dream that there's this lady that lives around the corner from me. Like, this is not real. This is this is my dream. There's this lady that lives, uh, like, down the road from me. And she has this daughter that's really young. Like, probably, like, three or four. And for some reason, I like, she's a stay-at-home mom. And she was able to, like, have... This is so strange. I cannot even tell you why this happened. But she's she has all this money saved up and she spends it on private concerts in her house with like the top celebrities so like taylor swift or like sean mendez or like whoever whoever that she's interested in or whoever her daughter's interested in she will have them come like once a month or something and like have these private concerts and she ended up inviting Taylor Swift to her house and I think because okay on the TikTok the girl was saying how Taylor was like sending her secret messages on Tumblr and that's how she like figured out how she was like coming how she was figuring out that she knew who she was and stuff and um Taylor had like posted on Twitter or something and was saying that she was coming to a small town in Tennessee and having like a private concert and kind of hinted where she was and I was like oh my gosh she's coming to that lady's house and I was freaking out and I was like oh my gosh I have to see if this lady will let me come to this concert because I'm a huge fan of Taylor Swift and 
this lady literally was such a Karen I'm not even kidding you she was so rude to me would not let me come to the concert and was like just so mean and tried to make me not come to this concert and somehow I finessed my way to getting into her into the house somehow like I think I offered to babysit or I was like I just tried everything that I could to let this lady be nice to me and let her let me see Taylor Swift's private concert and um and basically she like was kind of similar to the lady that I saw well she wasn't like rude or like the lady on TikTok was not rude but that's kind of where the dream went to I don't know it was really weird and I ended up I think I ended up going to the private concert but like it was the weirdest thing that that happened I don't even know I just had to mention that because I thought that that was really funny and let me know down below of any of your weird dreams because I always have some really strange dreams or if you've ever had any reoccurring dreams me and my cousin yesterday I went to my grandma's house for Thanksgiving and I didn't film it I'm very sorry I didn't bring my camera but um, me and my cousin were actually talking about reoccurring dreams and the weird dreams that we would have. And so I thought that since I had that weird dream last night and I remember it all, I thought I would mention it in a vlog because I thought it was very funny. So not that she's going to be watching this video, but Taylor Swift, if you ever have another private concert, please invite me. <laughs> I would absolutely love for her to invite me to one of those like things that she does where it's like, where she ends up filming it for TV and it's like a little intimate little concert that she does. I don't know if anybody has seen those before, but those are some really cool concerts and I would love to attend one. I actually have been to her Reputation tour and that was the only tour that I've been to of hers. But yeah, I just wanted to mention that and I thought it was really funny, but I think after I'm done putting my clothes away, I'm going to go downstairs and probably start making, I think I'm gonna just cook a corn dog um and that's gonna be my dinner as a corn dog and um cause i don't think we have any fries or anything but i do have um and i might make some chips and dip later i don't know i'm just kind of like not really knowing what i want to make i don't really want to cook a huge meal so i don't really know but that's probably what's going to be for dinner tonight and yeah i will talk to you